We live in a nation built on more torment than we like to believe, definitely more than the amount of masks on in this community. And if only they knew how uneven we breathe when we turn on the TV, the fear that eats us faster than Vaz Mussolini, cause while some of us go from straight jackets to suede jackets, I'm stuck replaying the image of my homegirl's casket. So my name is Nadia. I use she, her pronouns, and I go to Berkeley High. I'm a junior. I'm Hayden. I, I was a 2019 um, Youth Poet Laureate finalist, so it's been a couple of years, but still in it. <laughs> so I guess the first question for you would be, why poetry? Um, well, I guess for me, it's just, it feels like a great way to get my voice out there. Um, I am a songwriter, and so I feel like I use poetry a lot in my life. And um, yeah, it's just a way for me to like have my voice heard. So I really rely on poetry. Yeah. Yeah, that's great. I, I definitely relate to that. Do you find that your poetry is most of the time surrendered centered around youth or like general themes or like when there are characters like kind of characters do you use uh themes whatnot um i feel like my poetry is mostly centered on like how i'm feeling like it depends on how i'm feeling that day um and a lot of the time it's based off of personal experiences. So yeah. um, I have like a couple poems that are just like retelling events that happened in my life, but sometimes it can be stuff like, for example, like the war that's going on in Yemen, like how it doesn't like directly affect me, but how um, I see that it affects the people around me. Um, and so stuff like that, like just events that happen in my life and how I feel about it. Um, and I don't really use characters when I'm writing. I'll like mention um, people and like talk about myself sometimes, but I don't really have any like characters that I use. Yeah, it's it's definitely it's definitely a good way to take in the moment and digest it. Um, uh, is, I mean. <laughs> music starts with poetry and music's are, music is based off of our life experiences as well. So it's like, it's a good way to, for us to articulate and be able to understand what's happening around us. You know, because it, not only does it explain, it, it attaches a, a feeling to it. That's the most yeah. important part. How do you feel when you write poetry and when you perform poetry? Um, well, I feel like I feel different things. Um, like when I'm performing versus when I'm writing. Like, I feel like when I'm writing, it's, I feel really, um, I don't know. I feel like I have different feelings when I'm writing and usually like that's what I pour into my work. But when I'm performing, I notice that I always feel super like inspired and just happy. Like even if I am performing like a heavy piece, I always feel super like, I don't know, complete, I guess would be the word. Yeah, that's it. That's really great. Do you see um, songwriting and poetry as a form of leadership? And if yes, why? If no, why? I definitely see it as um, a form of leadership. When I think about like my cousins mostly, like that's, I don't know, like who I always like jump to when I think of like any type of leadership, like ideas I guess or opportunities like I noticed that for them as like young Middle Eastern girls like a lot of the time they feel like they're silenced and so I feel like if they see me performing my poetry and like speaking my truth they can also have that and I really really want that for them um, and so yeah definitely I think we can use this as a form of leadership. Yeah. How would you encourage other youth to step into that leadership role? Um, I mean, I guess I would say to 
you know, do it for themselves because it just makes you feel like, I don't know, like it makes you feel happier when you're inspiring other people, especially younger people. Um, just being able to speak your truth at the same time, like it's just, I feel like you get to gain a lot from leadership opportunities through poetry and through songwriting and through any like art form, you know, I feel like that's just a great way to go because you also get to do something that you're passionate about. So I, 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 I really do uh, look forward to seeing what you come up with, seeing what you do next, because, um, I mean, society needs to hear it. You know, we've got open ears. <laughs> Thank you so much. I know too well the negativity that settles rent-free in the brain, the pain from knuckles that crack and bleed against sleepless nights and peeling wallpaper. In reality, my heart is more shattered than Chernobyl windows. But my personality, that's where it really starts to come in handy, for it has more depth than the rings on a bristlecone pine tree. It helps me find my spark within the art of poetry.